Let's check in now with Chief Meteorologist Craig Setzer. He's looking pretty good. The arm's looking good, Craig. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, it, it, I wish it felt as good as it looks, but uh, <laughs> but yeah, it's out of the sling and uh, barely useful. How about that? Here's our latest uh, computer model of the radars across the country and the satellite. You can see this band of thunderstorms working its way to the east. This has been producing quite a bit of severe weather, a lot of wind gusts and damaging wind. There's still a tornado watch that affects parts of the Florida Panhandle, severe thunderstorm watch to the north of that. In terms of uh, the severe threat, it continues in. To North Florida later tonight and tomorrow. That's the highest tornado threat up here. Central Florida, kind of a medium tornado threat. And then down here, I think our main threat's going to be just from strong gusty winds with some of the heavier storms. Of course, you can never rule out the possibility of a tornado, but uh, it's going to be a pretty stormy day and probably in two rounds, too. The computer models, as I was saying uh, about 10 minutes ago, amazingly <clears throat> consistent bringing these thunderstorms up tomorrow morning. This is the 8 a.m. computer model forecast. And you can see much of the area under the gun here. Computer runs each hour have been very consistent showing this, and so it's probably a pretty good possibility that's going to happen. By afternoon, a break in the action, and then by the evening, here comes more storms into the area, so probably two, maybe even more rounds of thunderstorms tomorrow. 79 right now in Miami, 78 Fort Lauderdale, Hollywood, 81 in Key West. Six on the stick in the scale. Humidity has come up a bit. Southeast breeze and about 207 inch of rain from earlier storms. Highs today, mid to upper 80s. We'll be in the upper 80s tomorrow when we get into the sunshine. Temperatures right now in the upper 70s to right around 80 degrees in the breeze, blowing pretty good out of the southeast. Radar showing some showers mainly offshore right now. We're going to see some of those showers working their way onshore as we go through the night. A little bit of light rain in the lower keys, and this is probably going to be that area of thunderstorms that develops by the time it reaches South Florida. So sun and storms tomorrow. Several rounds of storms, but then some breaks in the storminess as well. Windy and warm and humid. Temperatures in the upper 80s to the low 90s. Saturday, the cold front comes through. Drier air comes in, clearing skies, a less humid breeze. By Saturday night, 60s for lows, 70s to low 80s on Sunday. Could see some 50s Sunday night for lows, even into next week, looking very, very nice. Who says we don't get nice cold fronts as we get into springtime? We still do. Here's our forecast for tonight. Breezy along the beaches, some quick showers, a low near 76. Tomorrow, look for a morning round of showers and storms, and then a late day or evening round of showers and storms, windy and warm, and some sun breaking through a high near 88. For boaters, pretty rough out there. Southeast to south winds, 20 to 25, seas up to 8 feet and choppy on the bays. Through the weekend, tomorrow is our rough day, and then it gets beautiful as we go through the weekend.